Welcome back, Spooks and Mooks, to the Splinter Cell Blacklist. Last time, we finished off the last of Coven's side ops, and so no more vacations from here on out. This time, we're heading back into the campaign with the Transit Yards in Philly. Hey, Anthony, how's it going, man? Charlie, I told you a hundred times, don't do that. You sound like an ass. Sorry, uh, sorry. Anyway, look, I was wondering if you wanted to do a little, you know, quid pro quo. What do you want for me? I got primo Iranian special forces security protocols for you to practice on if you've got what I need. You got cheap? Hey, I got source code, bro. Now, if you were willing to swap me some of those sweet cracking subroutines you're so good at, I could maybe see my way clear to sharing a little what I got. This better not be like that time you said you had root access at the bank in Sweden. But, come on, now why, why you gotta go bring that up? All right? Listen. Yeah, Charlie and his friend having a little conversation there, but I wanted to point out, no undetected checkbox in here. When I first saw this on my test run, I was all, this is not a good sign. I've already been put into two mandatory combat situations already that I couldn't avoid detection, kind of. And now they're throwing me one that's obviously going to have another combat situation. This one's not going to even be close to being undetected. Oh well. Do you have any updates, Ollie? The tracker's still moving south on the I-95. I pulled stills from the surveillance cameras along the route. Get those to Charlie. Anything changes, tell me. When are we gonna drop you in New York? Things change. We pull the partial license plate, start digging. On it. The tracker on the chemical weapon is just outside Philadelphia. We should have never let that shipment get stateside. What if we can't stop it in time? We're not gonna stop this attack. We're gonna stop all the attacks. But we'd also stop this one. I've been monitoring DCS interrogations right. coming out of Chicago. It's Sadiq not very clever, Sadiq. inner circle of commanders. DCS thinks they're responsible for coordinating the Blacklist attacks. We can take a commander alive. We could uncover plans for all of Blacklist. Pick the hell of a time to double down. The van they're in is rented, along with five others using the same bogus credit card number. The tracker. It's slowing. It's on East Oregon. Turning down South Columbus to city train yard. Pull the security cam seats. The other engineer vehicle's already there. The bombs could be armed. Land the plane. Philly International gave us the all clear to set up on their turf. Flight deck. Complete final approach. Any specs on that device we found in London? Standing by. I've confirmed a simple disarming procedure. Good. Charlie, I'm gonna need something to jam the radio in the area. We can't risk remote detonation. You bet. Briggs, you're with me on the ground. We move now. Hoorah! All right, enough bullshit. Time for the loadout. Popping smoke is optimal when you've got a lot of targets, a lot of hostiles, and a lot of open ground to cover. Thanks, Charlie. I know what I'm doing, goddammit. Anyway, that smoke's gonna be worthless. But I'm gonna make this a little easier on myself and finally get the crossbow. I've been holding off on getting this thing for a long time because it is overpowered, but like I indicated before, this one will have a mandatory combat section. And sleeping gas bolts will make this a breeze. And I like breezes. Now I've made this game hard enough on myself already. And this level just really pisses me off in a lot of ways, as you'll see. Hostiles in the back of the lead van. Take them out before they trigger that bomb. Ready. In position. Good visual. Driver's marked. Copy. Three, two, one. Sam, get to that first bomb before it detonates. Engaging target. So there you go. Anyway, let's go ahead and get out our new fancy crossbow. We're gonna be putting it to work pretty quick here. Go ahead and just give you a spinning hug. You'll notice there's a dead drop right here at the beginning. It's kind of hard to miss if you have the Paladin upgrades. So we'll go ahead and pick it up. There we go. And jump on this truck. Because we've got lots of targets down here. I like to tag them all with this new fancy crossbow. There is a guy with a down. gas mask in here. Look that guy right there. Down. You don't want to. You, you don't want to shoot him with gas. Area's clear, Sam. Coming down to meet you at the van. Because he will get pissed off and detect you and start shooting you. Not that detection's really a big thing in this level.
Grim, sailing the first bomb now. Copy. Deploying RF jam. Cool. Signal is good. We have the positions of three other devices, Sam. One in the tunnel near you, one in the maintenance yard, a third in the roundhouse. We got a ticking clock. That's too much ground to cover. We need to split up. They're sending their locations to your offset. Starting to sound like Grim. All clear. Grim, you got a line on the leader? I sent our best guest to your offset. Based on servant analysis, he's the engineer's point man on this attack. Let's go ask him. Break a leg, Briggs. Fish her out. What the hell did I just get myself into? That's what I want to know, Briggs, because watch out, folks. Briggs, hurry. Watch you need to this. Stop that bomb before they move it. Copy that. First person mode for Find no particular the reason. Find the nerve gas. Find the nerve gas. You shut this thing down. I'm not sure why they chose to do it this way, to be honest. Maybe they're trying to illustrate uh, Briggs' lack of experience, perhaps? So he doesn't have the observational skills of Sam Fisher? I mean, that's Change all I can actually think. He also doesn't have the cardio of Sam Fisher, the endurance. <sighs> Let's go ahead and take a look at what he has. You actually cannot do non-lethal takedowns as Briggs, which is insane, <laughs> but you can't. He also has a completely different loadout than Sam Fisher. You'll notice we're toting the H and K416. We're carrying the Beretta PX4 Storm 35. And our gadgets are all completely different. Just like we want them to be, right, folks? We also, you if you're astute, you may notice that we don't have a crossbow or a stun gun. It's like the game wants us to kill people this portion, but we won't. In fact, I'll ghost as much as I can. You do have to take down a few of these guys, but it's not a huge deal. Also, I was asking you to change to the proximity shocker for a reason. It wasn't to piss me the fuck off. Perhaps I didn't press a mouse button or something. <laughs> Alright, let's get moving. Got a lot of ground to cover here. It smells like Charlie's workshop in here. Well, that's not nice. Uh oh Elevator's starting up. We're headed this way. Yep. We gotta take down these three guys right here. We may have to take down a fourth one. You also note that this guy right here has a gas mask. It's important to note. The device ready to go? Just about. Up in the area of transport. How long before the unit's ready to move? We're close. He's down. Okay, I got them. Sleeping gas on you. Now, can I open it? I can't do it just yet. I need to take out the last guy over here. Whoops. Because he could almost get us. Does he have a gas mask on? No. Hopefully this goes where I want it. You actually can't get that nice little targeting arc either, which is a damn shame. There you go. Grim. I've reached the bomb. Grim. Briggs, hey. I got the full bomb schematic here from the shot Sam took of it in London. It's using an aerosol dispersal system. Now, I think that's how he got poisoned. It should be fine. All you gotta do is slide... Now, he got poisoned by being a dumb shit. I need Grim on the line now. And well, she's busy with Sam tracking the leader. Look, you think working with you is some kind of treat for me? Suck it up, Briggs. Just send the details to my offset, Charlie. Don't worry, Briggs. You can just walk this shit off just like Sam Fisher, right? Device is offline. Maybe he hasn't Briggs developed that location. kind of experience either. <laughs> Sam, engineers are priming the bomb on the other side of that viaduct. You've got to move. And now we get to be Sam Fisher again. What a treat. All right. Hey, Sam. SMI's guessing the area around the bomb is mined. Oh, great. Mine's my favorite. All right, we got snipers over here. Not a huge concern. Because they don't look all the way over here. We do have to watch out for mines. You can't fall on them. You just have to be dumb. And I have been dumb in my test run. So, it could even happen to someone else. Various noises just to scare me. All right, we're going to sit tight because we have... I think that's the same heavy, actually. He just moved over. I'm going to say, are you sweet? You are sweeping in my direction. Go ahead and jump down. Watch out for that mine on the other side there. Up. Watch out for these moves. Up. 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 Uh oh, 
That guy's coming back. Let's go ahead and sit tight for a moment. See him on the radar. Yep. Don't want to get seen by you. Especially since I need to take down that sniper. He's an HVT. I want to keep everyone else intact, though, because the ghost score for this one, even with the undetected checkbox non-existent, is pretty, pretty slim. Oh. Area's clear. All right, let's slow the hell down so he doesn't accidentally see us. Right, jump in here, take your ass down. Go oh, down nice and easy like Fisher. There you go. Good job. We'll just hop over the wall. It's like they designed this to be easy, right? Alright, now we get to another checkpoint. This one's a bit harder. The bomb's already been loaded onto the train. Communication still out? They're still down. Combo contingency plan is in effect. I want frequent face-to-face check-ins. Understood. Anything else? Keep trying to race him. I want to know as soon as this blackout clears. Will do. And as you work. All right, so we'll watch out for this command O. Then pass beneath us with no problems. Head over here, jump on a train. And just sit tight for a moment. There's a guy directly above us, but he's not a huge concern. We're going to sweep to the right here, because I think it's the easiest path. Probably is easier. It's just the easiest one I know. Okay, let's watch out for mines. These guys must have fucking balls of steel to work in this in this goddamn environment with all these mines just laying around, though. Fucking crazy. All right, let's hop up here. Don't you, don't you accidentally see me, you son of a whore? Gotta wait for this guy to turn around. Come on, do it. I know you're edge take because you almost saw me. Come on. Do it. Do it. Are we comfortable with the shock absorption in the housing? Come on, I don't want a few bumps setting this thing off early. He will eventually turn around. He's just being an asshole because I'm recording, of course. Alright, those guys are moving, unfortunately. I'm not sure how big of a problem they're gonna be. Oh, hello. Maybe they won't be much of a problem. Not yet. Jump the bomb. Alright, watch out for that mine. Some parkour for funsies. Sweep around back here. We need to get up to this tower also because there's a laptop in it. Alright, I'm going to wait here for a moment because this guy will swivel after a bit. And I don't want him to swivel right in my face. I'd like to actually get in there without taking him down if possible. I think he swivels to his right. Let's actually just do it. Okay, nothing bad happened. That's good. All right, let's head back. We're doing well so far. Those guys are having a little conversation back there. That's perfect. Okay, let him travel out. And get this. There we go. That went pretty well, actually. Not my first rodeo breaks. Not my first rodeo breaks. That's right. Oh, God. Come on, slow down, Hart. Device deactivated. Time for more Briggs. Our favorite. Copy. At the roundhouse. Visual on the leader. Negative. Charlie's still triangulating his position. I'll keep moving. Keep me posted. Don't the be afraid to use the your gadgets Second as way. Briggs, because they do the respawn, as you may know. The other side of that laser pops my head off. We're going to pop that over there, and now we're going to sit tight and wait for someone to trigger it. Because there's no reason to head out of this boxcar until it's clear. There is a sniper in this area. He's not a big concern. You could shoot him if you, that's your thing. But you don't need to. There we go. Alright. Very important to watch this doorway over here because there is a guy who will come out of it. Gotta wait for our sniper buddy. 
Maybe. Thought the sniper's honing in on me. I don't think so, though. All right. That guy's on the other side of creation, so that's a good chance house. for us to Where move. Where the hell is the bomb? I hope. Engineers are mounting it on a commuter train break. It was a good time to move. Okay, let's sit tight here for a moment. We got a target over there who may see us if we go too soon. Slow down, Hart. We can do this. All right, move, move, move before he turns right. Don't you get tired, Briggs. We need to make it. Okay, he almost saw me, but I sat down. It's not a huge concern. He's looking my way. I'm just going to go around here and sit in the stairs. Hold off until we get the word. Are you almost done on your end? Just a couple of settings left to adjust. The timer set. Timer and remote triggers are both online and breeding green. Perfect. All right, we're going to sneak out of here without disturbing either of these sons of bitches. Reporting all clear. All right. Make sure I'm sitting down. There's the heavy right there. We're just going to nudge over here and watch our radar. And then as soon as that heavy turns around, we're going to head out that way. You'll see the target, or the target, the uh, waypoint that we need to get to next. Nope, back. Okay, we made it. <laughs> come on, come on. Made it look I've easy. Once before. Hey, Charlie. I've reached the last device. Gotcha. Need me to walk you through it? No. Good. So no more bombs, folks. Shot breaks. Piece of cake. Oh shit, Charlie. I think I pulled a red wire. Is that bad? Oh, what? No gas. Get out of there. <laughs> gotcha. Asshole. You made me wet my pants, Briggs. Yeah. All devices disabled. Moving out. Remember when I said mandatory combat situation? Here we go. My favorite. Thankfully, does put us behind cover. We're just gonna let these guys move on. Alright, everybody, you just stay there. Nothing to worry about. Let's walk through the door, then open it. Stay down if you don't want to get Ow! Can't get the this thing. Did I get him? Okay, I got him. Okay, let's wait for the blaze screen to go away. Because you can get killed very quickly on Perfectionist. And for some reason, you can't adhere to some of these, for some reason. Like, I'm pressing Q right now, it's just not happening. Okay, we're good. Let's get moving. Get the commando. Get the commando! Thank you. Appreciate it. These are all combat knockouts, by the way, because, of course, we are in detected status. As to be expected. Now, I really don't care for this. You can't stay out there long, Sam. You're gonna hit the tunnel soon. There's not really a good way to do this, and also, there's no sense of urgency. You can't, like, send a gas grenade first, Fisher. Thankfully, we can't get behind stuff. Get smoked. Why are you not smoked? Okay, you're smoked. You have a shocker, because why not? We had a hostage situation, but that wasn't too bad. And now we should get the commander of this whole thing, right? There he goes, damn Sam Fisher. God damn it, shit. Please don't move. I'll shoot, I swear to God. I swear to God, he'll shoot him. This is Gareth, Officer 34. There's another one. I need backup now. Looks like a Easy. cheese grater, sir. Easy, everybody just relax. Let the hostage go. Well, there goes that lady. Idiot. Don't be a hero. I just got your buddy. Huh? Freeze! Don't move! You gotta be kidding me. Drop your weapon. Drop it now! Glad we didn't waste all that time, you know, getting poisoned with nerve gas, right, Fisher? For this? That was great, right? Good, good level, everybody. And I'm saying that facetiously. It's dumb. But we did get Ghost Mastery, 31 undisturbed hostiles, and 10 knockouts? Eleven knockouts! I did better than my test run. And I beat your score, Rev. And your time. What about Grimmiff? Have you actually played this one, Grimmiff? 
I'm waiting for it to show me. I guess I did get it. And no one was evaded, no one was killed, as much as the game wanted me to do so. I did have a few assault, you know, combat knockouts. I can't help it when you throw me into situations that can't be stealthed. In a goddamn stealth game. Stop. Stop my phone. And our time was pretty spectacular on there. I could have gone faster, but I think that was pretty good. Pretty good. I definitely could have done the last level faster, the one before this, but I was having a good time enjoying my vacation, okay? 24,549. And that's half a million dollars. Hazmat team scooped the bombs, and Sam's back from the Philly cop shop. Yeah, I heard. Look at you guys building rapport. Look, thanks for your help, right? What? Oh, nothing. I'm just in enjoying this little moment. Camaraderie. It's nice. Nice work up there. Thanks. First time I beat you back to the plane, huh? VX and terrorists. Our biggest threat turns out to be a trigger-happy subway cop. That didn't sound good. Everyone seems so happy boots. concerned that we lost our big fucking lead that you got poisoned over, Fisher. <laughs> Everyone's like, ah, good mission, everybody. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bad news? The engineers released another video. You will not stop the blacklist. Bring your troops home. Now. Well, so far they have building. stopped the blacklist. First, sorry. They sped up the attacks. Now they're just being bitches. <laughs> Cause of a whomp in their ass is so hot. Even our incompetent team of dumb fuckers. <laughs> oh god damn. Okay, let's look at that thing again. Transit guard. Got the checks that we could get. Uh, we got that. We got all the things. Not too shabby, even for a shabby level. Next time, our level actually does have the full check marks. I did check, so we shouldn't have a big problem. In fact, there's a treat for next, uh, for our next campaign mission, but that's two episodes from now. You'll have to see that then. For now, we're going to head to the loading bay and pick up some more recon data before I forget to do so. I actually keep forgetting to pick up the recon data before I start recurring again because, of course, it doesn't save when you pick it up. Which is regrettable. It's right over here. It's not hard to find. Special Missions HQ. Yep, I remember that place. That's where I was undetected. Alright. So let's go talk to everybody. I actually don't know what they're going to say yet again, so I have no prepared scripted bullshit for this. It's all off the cuff, folks. We'll talk to Sarah last. Any agencies calling a target for American fuel? DCS, Homeland Security, CIA. No one has anything. Or if they do, they aren't saying. We've kept one too many things from them. Still we don't piss them off. And Chicago and Benghazi. Yep. We've burned a lot of bridges, Sam. I guess so. That's all for now. Anyway, I've got a few leads of my own. Try not to roll the dice before I follow up, okay? We just don't want to blow our big, our big thing, you know that, by having them, like, leak it out. Briggles? Hey, Sam. Briggs. Sure cut it close back in Philly, Sam. It was the only way to get the job done. I guess we can agree to We didn't get the job that. done. I just wish that gamble had paid off with an engineer leader. Me too! I'll settle for saving a million people. I won't. We could have done better. <laughs> That's all for now. Talk to you later. All right, let's go talk to the Coban. <sighs> I'm sad that all of, her, all of his missions are done now. It's also a shame that they didn't have some kind of cutscene after we did all of his missions, although I'm not sure what he'd tell us. Maybe we could have a nice, like, situation where all... Coban, you're finally part of the team. This is your new room. It's still in the holding cell. Go. Hey, Sam. I've been meaning to ask. Where's Vic? None of your business. I'm just asking. I heard some of the crew talking about him being in the hospital. You are not another one of your vengeance trips, are you? Drop a code. I'm not gonna say it again. You're not gonna hurt me again, right? Please. I don't want to be hurt again. That's all for now. Board. 
Okay. Okay. See you around, Fisher. See you around, Coven. At least we have these little discussions with him. He has no idea what's going on in the outside world, so they're always fresh, you know. I never know what he's going to talk about. I'm sure Charlie's going to talk about the mission. Hey, Charlie. Hey, Sam. Did you hear that Vic's out of intensive care? Oh, you're not. Oh, cool. You talked to him? No, he's uh, still unconscious, but his condition's been upgraded to stable. He's a stable vegetable. That's Thanks for good. the update, Charlie. Make sure they contact us as soon as it's up. You bet. I think we're good. Catch you later, Sam. All right, we're good. We've talked to everyone except for the daughters, so let's head there next. Arnie, I, I, I stopped another terrorist attack. Did a good job. Didn't catch, it. Didn't catch the leader, though. Failed again. Yeah. Sarah, just wanted to see if you're okay. What happened in Philadelphia? There's no way that transit cop stopped anything. It's a long story. I don't believe everything you see on the TV. I was on TV, by the way, too. probably. But you're okay? I'm fine. I'm trying to stay ahead of the blacklist and short circuit a war. <sighs> yeah. The president's flip flopped again. She says there's new evidence. People. people are buying it. Well, that's my cue to get back to work. Everything's your cue to get back to work. Don't let me stop you. Never did before. You're the reason I'm doing this, kiddo. One of them, Dad. But it's enough. I'll talk to you soon. That's good, kiddo. Glad you're doing all right. Daddy's doing all right, even if he's being held up by gun, at gunpoint by Philly cops. And failing, and being dumb. Oh well. Maybe next time we'll have a good mission, folks, because we'll be taking on the last of Grimm's missions, which, as I understand, is quite good. So, I'll see you then, Super Spies.